Hello friends, welcome to Sandeep's Biology. So in this video, I'll be talking about identical and non-identical twins. Now in most of the cases, woman gives birth to a one individual or one child at a time. But in certain cases, when woman gives birth to more than one child at a time, it is known as multiple birth. So multiple birth is known as giving birth to more than one child at a time and it includes giving birth to two individuals at a time which is known as twins if there is birth of three individuals at a time then it is known as triplets and if four individuals are born at a time it is known as quadruplets and if five individuals are born at a time it is known as quintuplets so quintuplets are birth of five individuals at a time in this video i will be talking about different types of twins right so twins is a kind of multiple birth so there are two types of twins identical and non-identical twins so let's see about identical twins first identical or which are also known as monozygotic twins monozygotic means the word itself suggests that it is developing from single zygote right so in this case when an ovum is fertilized by a sperm so this ovum is fertilized by a sperm and after fertilization zygote is developed right so this zygote is developed and cleavage of zygote is started so when there is division or cleavage of this zygote is there two blastomers are formed so these are two blastomers and these two blastomers get separated from each other right so these two blastomers get separated from each other and these two blastomers will develop into two different embryos right so these two blastomers will develop into two different embryos and two individuals birth of two individuals will be there so which are known as twins or identical twins right there are several characteristics of identical twins so let's see about it here you see that two blastomers are developed into two different embryos so there is this division is mitotic division right so it is mitotic division as this is mitotic division these two blastomers will develop into two different embryos and these different two different embryos share same sets of gene so they have same chromosome sets same chromosomes chromosome sets they have identical genes right both of these individuals or embryos have identical genes and one more interesting thing about these identical or monozygotic twins is that they are of same sex right so they are of same sex so if male twins are there both are both embryos are of male sex or if female is there then both of the individuals are of 
female so they are of same sex now let's see about non identical twins or which is known as fraternal twins or also known as dizygotic twins so they are known as non identical or fraternal or dizygotic twins so in this case usually women during the menstrual cycle release one ovum at a time but in certain cases during the menstrual cycle woman releases two ova at a time so these two ova these two ova gets fertilized by two different sperms right so two different sperms fertilize these two ova and zygote is formed after fertilization and these two different zygote will develop into two different embryos right and these two different embryos will give birth to further develops and will give birth to two different individuals so in case of non identical twins as these ova and sperms are different they have different chromosome sets right so they have different chromosome sets they have non identical genes so genes are non identical and in case of identical twins we have seen that they are of same sex but in this case they can be of same sex or they can be of different sex so they can be of same sex or they can be of different sex say for example if these two ovas are having x chromosomes right if the sperm containing x chromosome fertilizes this ova then the embryo will be female so female individual will born and if y chromosome containing sperm fertilizes the ova then male individual will born so depending on the chromosome of the sperm if x chromosome fertilizes the ova then female will born and if y chromosome containing sperm fertilizes the ova then male individual will born so they can be of same sex or they can be of different sex but in this case in monozygotic or identical twins they are of same sex only so that is about identical and non identical twins i hope this video is helpful if you are watching this video till here please hit the like button share this video with your friends if you want more videos like this then subscribe to my channel thank you for watching